behind me, I have all four WeCreate lasers that are in the market right now. Here is the Vista, the Vision 20, the Vision 40, and the Vision Pro. All these lasers have different watts and work differently. The second and third, the 20 and 40, are very similar. But today we're gonna start a series of videos where I can explain better how each one of these laser works so you can do your own research to find the best for your business, to start your business, expand your business, or for just your hobby. Let's get started. So here is the Vista from WeCreate. This is a diode laser 10W. It has a camera under the lid. And what made this laser unique and a very special one last year is that although it has a small sclerence, you are able to make tumblers. Why is that a big deal? Usually to be able to make tumblers or engraved tumblers, I should say, you need a, a higher um, space between the laser head and the bottom to be able to accommodate a rotary attachment. And for this laser, they may, or we, we can make something different flipping the laser head, that way you don't need a lot of clearance like the other machines. Let me show you up close. To use a rotary attachment on the weekly Vista, you pull the game tree or the laser head to the front of the machine and place the rotary attachment where it belongs. Remember that you need the machine to be off before installing the rotary attachments. And then simply take the laser head. It has two screws on this side. So unscrew each uh, of the screws and then flip the laser head. And that way you are ready to use the primary attachment. In another feature that this machine has is that you can exchange the laser head to an infrared laser with another uh, head. And for that, you, you have to unscrew the same uh, side screws and remove four screws that are the, at the top and that way you, you exchange one head to another head. For the rotary attachments, Wiki has two, the original one and the Twe Pro. They upgraded the rotary attachments because the laser head was not able to engrave uh, a, spa a, a space uh, on the left of the rotary. Meaning that when you want to engrave a tumbler, you are not able to engrave a big part of the left side. For that, the different attachments that were created and people uh, came uh, across and shared them, like this one here, to be able to extend the tumbler attachment and be able to engrave better and the whole tumbler. And the Pro, that is part of the, uh, the newer version of the we create. And with this, you are fixing some of those problems. Uh, with this one, I'm not able to use the some tumblers, so I use this attachment and fix that situation. Yes, you're able to engrave different type of tumblers. For example, this was created with the WKV Vista. The important detail uh, on your choice is that remember that a 10W is going to take longer to engrave something like this. Another feature is that you can add these, I call them legs, 
but depending on the bundle that you buy from we create you can add this and then you can remove the um chrome tray and removing the chrome tray and having those legs you're going to be able to have more clearance to engrave larger or taller objects and the laser head is going to have enough space to be able to engrave them like this bottle i engraved them with the wikri vista as any other dial laser it has its limitation cutting acrylic you can cut black or red acrylic but remember i don't recommend a diet if you really want to cut all colors of acrylic because you are not going to be able to cut some colors like transparent or mirror acrylic you are able to cut and engrave wood engrave items like this and cork engrave glass but in consideration that to engrave glass, you're going to need some kind of medium for the diode or blue color, blue laser to see your glass. And as other lasers, you can engrave on ceramic, but you will also need a medium or paint to do this. What else would you like to know about the Vista? I'm here to help. Stay tuned for part two, where we're going to explain and discuss the Vision 20.